Hello and welcome to the SBC News 90. Here's today's top stories. The Department for Digital Culture, Media and Sports has pledged £300 million to safeguard professional sports in immediate future. Confirmed in its sports winter survival package, emergency funds will be made available to the sports governing bodies to distribute to clubs and organisations that have been affected by the ongoing COVID-19 pandemic. UK Racing has secured £40 million reserved for racecourse management. The UK Greyhound Board of Great Britain will receive £1 million to protect its stakeholders and safeguard the sport's welfare through the winter period. Michael Arana, Director General of Spain's DGOJ, has urged Congress to support his initiative to introduce changes to the gaming law in order to reclassify loot boxes as games of chance. The DGOJ is reportedly seeking guarantees that loot box laws and gaming protections will be included in the next phase of federal gambling reforms sanctioned by the Ministry of Consumer Affairs. The government will draft the final text of the law during the consultation period, which aims to be published by mid-2021, focusing amendments on aligning responsible gambling standards and consumer safeguards. Gemma Collins has partnered with Playojo in a campaign to raise awareness for safer gambling. The campaign poses as a fake perfume advert for Collins, stating addiction with no smell, the smell being an acronym for the various sides of problem gambling, including sleep, money, extreme, losing and lying. You can find more on this story at gamblingtv.com. And that's all for today. I'll be back tomorrow for your next SBC News 90. Bye bye.